Welcome back for all you uh, people that haven't uh, heard from us in forever. We have risen. So much. Yes. So much has changed since the last time we recorded. We come to you now at the turn of the tide. But uh, yeah, starting out on a depressing note, um, in the uh, immortal words of, of Aaron Hansen, uh, uh, Jennifer dumped me. So <laughs> my total my total real girlfriend and I are no longer together, and that's where this story starts out, is... Uh, I'm back on the dating scene. I'm talking to ladies, and I'm like, they're like, what are you doing this week? And I'm like, hanging out with my bro, recording some content. And I'm like, content for what? He, he, he. And I'm like, I will never tell you about my channel unless this goes horribly. And then in which case, I will tell you to check out the channel. <laughs> because things are said. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe. Never Man. contact me on Tinder ever again. Some women getting some <laughs> some women getting in cat fights in the comments like this fucking you know I'm just like I didn't do this I'm sorry no. But You'll anyway. never know about the channel until something goes horribly right or horribly wrong. <laughs> horribly wrong. <laughs> YouTube can it go too far? Um, but yeah, welcome back guys. It's been a long time since we saw you. We missed your sexy faces. Um, we're damn at, right. Things are settling down into a sense of normalcy. We now have two grump spaces so. You know, you may be hearing from us on multiple occasions from multiple places, so... Yep. But yeah, uh, we're going to try Hitman 2 out. Neither of us have played this, and uh, we're going to take turns, and it's going to be a it's gonna be a shit show. So, it's free on PlayStation Plus, and uh, yeah, I don't know. I've never played one of these games, so... But we're going to try today. Alright, I have to... Oh, man. Uh, Sign my life away. <laughs> I, I'm i going to be honest. Unless you're a closet speed reader, I don't think you read that. Hey, listen. Are you lying to the fine people at Square Enix? I am lying. No. Why would I? I don't lie. Marines don't lie, man. Come on. Uh, I think we should do Spanish. No, let's not do that. That's stupid. Uh, hey. Of course. You want to go Portuguese. Portuguese. Uh, Afrikaans. <laughs> do we want subtitles? Yeah, I don't, yeah, it's quiet. I don't give a fuck. Whatever. Who cares? Just do subtitles. Let's go to the fucking game. Subtitles make it easier for those of us with bad ears, which isn't me. Um, oh my god, I've developed like multiple hobbies since yeah. the last time we recorded. Yeah, uh, tell the world about them. What hobbies have you come come to? Like my COVID hobbies uh, came around in custom keyboards, uh, getting way too into coffee, mm -hmm. okay. and getting way too into headphones. Pretty standard. Yeah, headphones are pretty sick, man. I mean, you are an audiophile. We kind of did that to each other. We're like, oh. Ooh, IQ Interactive game. All right. I think it was IO Interactive. Oh, IO. Stories I can't so see. Far. All right. Agent 47 and his handler, Diana Burnwood. Are the world's top <laughs> sounds like a penis joke. <laughs> handler sounds like a handjob joke. With all of their recent missions turn out to be contracts <laughs> for a shadow client. Ah, uh, welcome back. Is that fucking Wolverine? Ah, uh, no, that's solid. That's solid-ish snake. Solid-ish. <laughs> Discount version. <laughs> He's on sale at Walmart. <laughs> We're gaming. Uh, All right. Secretly owns our mm -hmm. okay. Is that water or glass? Uh, or is it really fast-moving sand? It's an ocean of placenta. Oh. Was that? Uh, was that? Um, the guy. Guy. Was that? Uh, German bad guy from Inglorious Bastards? I thought it was bad guy from Half-Life. Oh, uh, the G-Man? Yeah, the G-Man. <laughs> I've never played Half-Life. I don't think the G-Man is a bad guy. He's not? No, no he's not know. really a bad guy. He's not really a good guy either. Is this a Hitler did nothing wrong argument? No, it's it's, it's <laughs> legit. I don't think he's a bad... You know what? I'm the wrong person to say. I've played OG Half-Life a billion okay. times. Uh, I've played Half-Life 2 a billion times. Whoa, calm down on the bomb. Ugh. Calm down on the oh, Rockstar oh, on the Rockstar bomb. I didn't even think about that. I was just like, I want the world to hear me take a delicious sip. <laughs> a delicious sip of my Rockstar bomb. Damn. Agent People 47 are... is shredded. He is genetically engineered. Oh, he is? I yeah. Know that. Again. Oh, I oh. love how the fucking lighting just fucking exploded brighter as soon as the game started. We're playing. Do I have a dodge roll? Zero out of ten. Turn it off. <laughs> What you do I? have like a weird red lanyard uh, hang off the hang off your back. We can't see it right now because of the um, lighting. Is this HDR? Uh, yes, I have 
4K TV now. Reyna is one of the Shadow Client's top lieutenants. Shadow Client. And she's not a target. Yeah. It will not turn up on the on the capture at all. I almost guarantee it. That's fine. We're kind of only going to upload in 1080p. Upload 240p. Compressed audio. Am I supposed to be listening? Am I supposed to be doing stuff? I don't fucking know. I'm not really paying. What does that say? Use it says running. L. Use L and L1 to run. Oh, oh my god. god. This the the stuff is so small. Why do I have to hold? I'm getting button? flashbacks to when I played Dead Rising on my CRT. Why do I have to hold the button? To run, like I thought we were past this. Am I the only one who remembers that? But like, if you play, tried to play a like Xbox 360 on a CRT, the uh -huh. text was small on a lot of games because no, it wasn't designed for that aspect ratio. So that TV I have in the other room, I literally bought that because I bought a PlayStation 3 and Metal Gear Solid 4, and I could not read the fucking text on my fucking shitty CRT. I'm glad I'm not alone. So I went out and bought this, like... And honestly, it's been a good flat screen. I've had that since 2008, and it's currently 2021. Way to date the video. All right, I'm hiding in the bush. Way to date the video. All right, well, to... uh, you did break up with your girlfriend, so if you need to date something, I guess the video is... Uh, uh, I'm in a, a relationship option. with the gem. <laughs> oh. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Equip the pistol. Oh, I gotta shoot the camera. How do I... What is it? Is that right on the D-pad? Ah, it is right. All right. Destroy camera. Hold L1, oh, L2, okay. Pretty sure if you just flash it, your balls will explode. I could just sneak past it. No, you need to destroy it. Yeah, well. Tutorial <laughs> says destroy it. Now, according to the local home security provider, this is going to be an unmitigated disaster. Placed around the perimeter. I'm just remembering this. I, God, I so wish we recorded that. I'm remembering the tutorial from fucking. Uh, Metal Gear Solid Five, and how oh. much you just died the during that. The fact that I dropped a grenade on the roof that killed, knocked me off, and I just, uh, that you was, died from the fall damage. You know, I, I I actually like that game a lot, but man, that was a tough intro. I like Kojima. He was losing his fucking mind. I feel like I've told this story on camera before, but who, who cares? cares? It's been so uh, long. It, he was losing his goddamn mind for the entire like hospital escape opening section. Just going insane, wanting to just play a traditional Metal Gear Solid game, whatever the fuck that means. Yes. <laughs> well, that's the thing. I, I like, I like, I like Kojima games. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bullshit about that. Then when the game finally opens up, it starts like the tutorial level. It's teaching you how to walk it around the open world. He gets on the rooftop to destroy a fucking uh, satellite, drops a grenade at his feet, blows up. And mm. kills him, and he's like, I'm done. I don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> I, I was also extremely tired. Look, I'm hiding. All right, it was also the day that we heard a lot of really just top tier Metal some Gear Solid puns. Some of the best jokes you'll ever hear. Oh, I, I don't. Do I, ha I have keys to get in? But I, I will never it. forget the birth of Liquid Sauce a lot. Liquid Sauce a lot, man. That's the best joke. If you're ever at a party, use the Liquid Sauce a lot joke. It goes like this. You talk to your friends who are also in the Metal Gear, because if they're not, they're going to call you a loser and make fun of you forever. But essentially, you just say, do you think that when Liquid Ocelot retires from being a bad guy, uh, he opens up a burger joint and his favorite burger is the Liquid Ocelot burger? I think it started with a joke about Big Boss Burger. Or no, yeah, it was Big Sauce Burger. He opens a barbecue burger joint called Big Sauce Burger. And then Liquid Ocelot comes in, they call him Liquid Ocelot because he always gets extra sauce. <laughs> yep, there we go. <laughs> and then and then and then uh, they also have uh, shakes called the liquid shake. And you can get concretes called the solid shake. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even have a follow up for that now. Uh, and then you can get actual ice cream called Episode Over. Called the solidus shake. But if it, after it starts to melt a little bit, it and becomes the solid-ish snake. <laughs> ah, we looped it back around. Hey, perfect high five. There we yeah. go. We made that happen. Um, but so good. Can I? I'm so good at callbacks. Oh, seven and a half pick. minutes into the episode. Uh, I don't have a lockpick. Okay. But um, it's in your inventory. No, it says missing. The little uh. Well, just the, that's exactly like Agent Forty Seven loses his goddamn keys. That, that, little, that little red thing says missing, so I gotta. Of course, he's mi fucking loses his goddamn keys. The fuck? Why do oh, we? It's a wind chime. Um, but oh yeah, I had I had uh, one more. Yeah, if you go through the drive through drive through, it's called the ride in. Because you ride in. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> that was that was more for me than you know. 
uh, what what was the name of the uh, what was the name of the big uh, uh, Walker things in MGS four? Uh, the geckos. Yeah. The geckos. The geckos. Why no, am I sneaking? There's not. That, there's... All the burgers are called geckos. The geckos. Why are they called geckos? Because what sound do the geckos make? Oh, they moo like cows. That's good. And when it's delivered to you, it goes like it's, the cows. It's, it's, it's delivered to you on mechanical legs. On and when mecha- they walk in, <laughs> when the giant mechanical legs bust in the ceiling from the kitchen. <laughs> I'm not fucking with you. We should make this. <laughs> I mean, I have it. It'll be like Fritz's downtown. Down. Uh, downtown where the little uh, trains bring the food out to you. Oh, dude. Only it's giant robot legs that come and moo at you in a horrifying... All of our waitresses and waiters Oh, God, that waveform. Like, they're, dressed, they're dressed up like various uh, uh, Metal Gear characters, and they're like, I've walked around this place twice now and have accomplished nothing. <laughs> I, I feel... I, why do we have to keep firing the, the uh, server that's dressed like Vamp? <laughs> He's killing our customer. <laughs> and it's he pulls up... Dude, one of my favorite videos about Metal Gear Solid... Wait, what is that? <laughs> Dude, where, what do I do, man? I'm, I'm, you need to find a way into the house! I've been trying to... Can I shoot this? What does that do? Nothing. Uh, it... Oh, I broke it. Well, you sure circuited it. That's for sure. What does this do? I don't have a lockpick, so I'm just... Oh, I can climb that. There we go. You did it. You gave me a button. Prime. Perfect. Let's climb this thing. I like how you stopped sneaking at this point, and you're literally just walking around this house. Well, it's like, what the fuck? Like, someone's gonna walk by and be like... You guys see the the bald guy in a wetsuit just walking around that guy's house? How do I reload? Is it a square? Circle? Nope, nope, that's sneaky sneak. Triangle? Nope, that's vault. No, we're our. Oh, oh, thank God you didn't. Uh, no, oh, no. You're undoing all the work you've all done. Our, okay. Uh, hmm. Maybe Circle? I go like this, and then I. No. Nope. Oh, star one. Hey, you figured it out. All right, now. It's a Mega Man. Mega Man uh, X need, learning I, by just pressing is. all the buttons. But you, you, let's assume you're gonna press some buttons. Uh, my favorite Metal Gear Solid Four video is a re- the review Matthew Matosis did. That's like an hour and a half long. And there's a line in it towards the end where he's talking about the vamp fight, and he goes, "Vamp pulls out a stupid penis knife to show how one-dimensionally evil he is." And I'm just like, "That line, <laughs> fucking kill!" Because it's like this serious, in-depth review, but you can sense some. Is that a anger. giant from Dark Souls? I don't know, but I like it. I kind of want that. No way! I think that's just what all for one from from uh, my hero. My hero. Oh yeah, <laughs> my hero. It's uh, it's okay, but they're focusing way too much on the villains. I don't want to sympathize with them or like them. Is this open? Does not look like it. This dude is using some great Windex. I just gotta say, look at that lens flare. This lens flare improves the game. That's amazing. okay. In in the manga, we've gotten to the point where uh, it's stupid ridiculous. There were four issues that were just entirely on Uraraka trying to convince a bunch of human survivors to let Deku come rest at the fucking uh, high school again. Didn't Deku, like, run away because, like, he, he like, they're he not that far strong. in the show, and he's like, oh, I gotta run away because I'm gonna hurt my friends, and you're like, you don't have to do that. You can just hang out. Dude, what the fuck? Dude, I want this. Uh, I feel like I would just meditate there and Me then too. fall asleep. Put my PC, I'd put my PC out here. Oh, I can't sit. Oh, well. You can. I tried to. It wouldn't let me. I hit triangle and everything. I like how the, the button, pr- oh, the button, whoa, that's cool. I like the button prompt. That's neat. I like that. But anyway, um, my HDR might be a little off because the wall should not look like it's glowing. Also, is that a face? What the fuck is going on? I guarantee someone is watching this right now like, Oh my god! Make something Look at the the high quality textures in that. That's that fucking crazy like 352 inch uh, TV I sent to the thread. Come to the Discord thread if you guys haven't. The, The halls of filth. Yeah, it's totally open to anyone who wants to... Open to the public, if I invite you. Alright, <laughs> none of these doors work. I hate this. What do we do? Okay, is there another thing I can scale and or vault? Process of elimination. There's some stairs. You're in. Good work. Oh. What?! How am I in? Why is why would they not lock this door? It's at the ground level. Well, I, I guess they assume no one's gonna climb up a pipe over a railing. Electronic devices. You know the drill. I don't... It won't... I can't get in. What? What? Um. 
Oh god. Oh. <laughs> you have limited ammo. Oh, uh, well. I feel like we might be missing something because of how dark it is. Maybe. Might need to adjust the picture on the TV. Uh. Maybe, can we bump the gamma in the game at all? Let's find out. Oh. If this is really stupid, then we could just, you know, always cut shit. But save, load, restart, mission, exit to main menu. I can't do shit. How dare you? Oh, wait. Gameplay. Graphics. Gamma correction. Once well, the barcode barely barely visible, but, um... Yeah, fuck that. That... I feel like that did not help. That did... That definitely did not help. Uh, graphics. Maximum power. Rendering. Uh... I don't really care. Frame rate's unlocked, baby. Alright. What was the HDR setting there? Uh... Uh, graphics, HDR. Uh, HDR's off. That might be why. Oh, no, HDR. Mm, it's probably because of the capture software. Nah, whatever. We're just here to party. All right. If I have to look up a video how to beat the tutorial, I'm, go I'm going to be depressed. Was I supposed to find a lockpick somewhere? You know, uh, so from what okay, I recall... Okay, all right. This might be an Aaron Hansen moment. I'm just saying... Because I guarantee you when they were talking, they were like, oh, you need to go get your lockpick out of this fucking van somewhere. And we were like, oh, what are your big peepees? And then <laughs> and I'm like, what do I do? Where do I go? Here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to let you guys... I mean, I feel like Hitman's got the ability to kick the fucking door down. I'm just saying. What's on the What's on the stand there? Stand? Yeah, it's on the like side stand. <laughs> Maybe it's something on the grounds. Like, if you look around on the grounds, you'll, like, find, like, a briefcase full of your shit. Yeah, that could be it. I, I, I feel like I was supposed to get a lockpick somewhere. Because it's in, like, it's like, oh, you're missing this. I'm like, why am I missing the lockpick and the crowbar? Are those essential to my... Oh, I can switch shoulders. Nice. I hate that I have to hold L1 to run. This makes me feel like I'm playing a game from, like... The only thing worse than this is tank controls. I'm just saying. Resident Evil, looking at you. Haven't played it, but fuck you. Alright, hold on. Wow. Alright, cool. Strong feelings. <laughs> Wait, what's that? Wait, what was that? What are you? The uh, poker. I can kill someone with this. How do I... Can you bash the window in? I... Can you shoot the window in? I tried shooting the windows earlier and it didn't do anything. You just left a little. Hey, look, a lighthouse. Do you think William Defoe's over there? Do you, you watch that movie? Mm, no, I think William Defoe is busy being Green Goblin again. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. And it's got Doc Ock. He's like, <sighs> good to see you, Peter. And I'm like, yeah. good to see you, Peter. Um, okay, we're going to pause this. Uh, and uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next episode. Sorry for wasting your time. <laughs> well, we'll figure this out and we'll be back. We promise. Shut up and sit down.